Welcome to Informed Investor. In a surprising turn of events and for the first time ever, the Tata Group and Ambani-led Reliance will partner in a joint venture marking a significant event. And that's not it. Reliance are also eyeing on a major merger deal between Reliance and Disney that could create India's largest media and entertainment business. Let's discuss this. First up, Mukesh Ambani owned Reliance is in discussions to acquire a 29.8% stake in Tata Play from the Walt Disney Company. If you look at the shareholding, Tata Play, earlier known as Tata Sky, has Tata Sons as its largest shareholder. Walt Disney owns about 29.8% stake with Temasek, a Singapore-based fund, holding 20%. And if negotiations go through, Reliance would acquire the 29.8% stake of Walt Disney and deepen its footprint into India's television distribution sector and expand the reach of its OTT platform. Moreover, Reliance would offer its complete GeoCinema content into Tata Play's offering for its customers. In context, Reliance has presence in the Indian television distribution sector through Hathaway and Den on the MSO, which is multi-system operator, but does not have DTH, which is direct-to-home presence. With this acquisition, Reliance would enter the DTH segment, which has a more premium customer base, thereby consolidating market share, potentially leading to higher pricing power and reduced competition. Interestingly, this could mark the first time Tata Group and Reliance will partner in a joint venture. On the other hand, with the breakdown of the recent Sony and Z merger, Disney and Reliance are making headlines reaching final stages of negotiations to finalize their mega stock and cash merger with 17 February as the deadline. Disney has reached preliminary agreements to sell about 60% of its linear TV, content and OTT business in India to Reliance, marking the biggest merger in the media and entertainment industry. To be precise, Reliance will inject $1.5 billion in cash to acquire a 51% stake in Disney India, valuing the business at approximately $3.5 billion while Bodhitri will acquire 9% stake. Disney will retain about 40% in stake in the merged entity. Through this deal, Ycom 18, owned by Reliance, will become the largest individual shareholder in the merged entity, potentially holding a stake of 42-45%. to 45%. Post the deal, the new entity will be board managed with Reliance as they have a majority, while Disney may settle for 3 on a board of 8-9 to nine members. In context, Disney Plus Hotstar had 61.3 million subscribers back in September 2022. And ever since the loss of IPL streaming rights to Viacom 18, Disney Plus Hotstar has witnessed a steady decline in subscribers. To make things worse, the fall through of Z plus Sony merger also played a part in the decline in Disney's India's valuation as Disney India was in talks to merge its Star India business with Sieb Entertainment and Sony Pictures Networks India. To conclude, the Indian media market is highly competitive with OTT players like Netflix, Amazon Prime, Geo Cinema, Disney Plus Hotstar, Sony Live, etc. Reliance foraying into the DT segment will strengthen Geo Cinema's reach and consolidate market share. As mentioned, it would be a first of first with Tata and Reliance collaborating together. All in all, these deals mark a significant shift in the Indian media landscape with Reliance emerging as a dominant player. While these events are yet to be finalized and concrete, it's interesting to see how it paves out. Having said that, this is me, Ralison, signing off. Have a great day and stay safe. Did you like watching this video? Then download our app, Informed Investor, to watch more such informative and interesting videos. Equity investments are subject to market risk. Read all investment-related documents carefully. Visit www.researchandranking.com.